The Birmingham Waterworks Board is fighting to repair its customer service reputation. Today, members announced improved helpline, wait times, and ways to battle high bills. WVTM 13 News reporter John Papke takes a look at the public relations strategy. The Birmingham Waterworks Board broke out a water meter showing her customers to monitor for leaks uh, and then to look at the faucets and the toilets to kind of make sure what's going on there. Jeff Goodwin has handled water meters for 25 years. To uncover a leak, he says find your water meter in the yard. If all your water is cut off and this red triangle turns at all, you have a problem. That's why they put this on here so you can see that. So you can tell if your toilet flapper valve is leaking through, if your pop-off valve on your hot water tank is leaking. Rule number one is that the customer is right. Rule number two is what if the customer is wrong, see rule number one. General Manager Mac Underwood admitted they do make mistakes. One board member asked him about water meters like this one, which appeared to have not been read for months. We have had some reports of those kind of issues, and we're trying to address those issues. The meter readers really should see that and report that back. And if a customer thinks their meter was read incorrectly, they want them to report it promptly. I actually encourage any customers to come forth with any concerns because we can use that as an opportunity for education. So check your meter for leaks. Hundreds of dollars could be washing away. Now, the Waterworks Board says they have also beefed up their customer call center right now. There's about two dozen people on hand here during the day to hear your complaints. The Waterworks Board says that that has lowered the average wait time for a customer calling in here down to two minutes and 12 seconds. Reporting live in Birmingham, John Papke, WVTM 13 News.